A database can be defined as a collection of information that has been deliberately designed for organized searching. So basically, databases are a way to organize the oceans of information that are available and make it easier for us to access what we want or need from them. Just about anything can be put into a database. In our case, SLCC library databases will contain things like scholarly research articles from various academic journals, newspaper articles, magazine articles, ebooks, audio, video and images, test preparation for licensure, certification, or entrance exams, government documents, and that's just to name a few. All of the library's databases are designed, created, and managed by outside vendors. The SLCC library works with these companies on your behalf so you can access them for your class assignments. For example, you might use the databases for your research papers, essays, presentations and speeches, group projects, or to simply expand on what you've been learning in your classes. To access the library databases, go to the SLCC website at solacc.edu and click on the library link. Once you're at the library's website, click on Research Databases. There are multiple ways to find a database that can help you. For instance, if you need to find research for your psychology paper that you're writing, you could use the Database by Subject filter to show you the best databases that contain information related to psychology. Or maybe you need a primary source for your history assignment. In that case, use the Database by Content filter to find databases that contain primary sources in them. Sometimes, an instructor may recommend a specific database for you to use. So, if you already know the name of your database, you can search for it here. Or, click on the letter the database's name starts with and scroll down to find it. No matter what method you use to find a database that can help you, always remember that under the name of each database, there is a short description that gives you more details about what you will find in it. Once you've decided which database you want to use, simply click on the name of it. If you are already on an SLCC campus, it will go directly to the database's search screen, so you can begin searching for what you need. However, if you are accessing a database from your home or anywhere else off campus, it will take you to a login screen first, in order to confirm that you are a current student at SLCC. Once you have successfully logged in, it will take you to the search screen so you can begin your search.